fellow YouTubers, so dude Gecko30 here, and I am back, guys, playing Mass Effect 3 Legendary Edition. So, guys, in the last episode, we managed to finish the Omega DLC and managed to begin a part of the Circus mission. So, pretty much, yeah, now we're finally gonna continue it, guys. So, let's see what lies ahead, shall we? Solarians come from, huh? No wonder you're so soft. Too busy writing poetry about waterfalls. <laughs> Shepard, I don't like this. I should be the one going in. How about you stay here and we only fight one war at a time? That was just good old-fashioned Krogan hot air. If it had been real, they'd be dead. Idle threats are empty threats. <laughs> Maybe when this war is over, you can come live on Tuchunka. You'd fit right in. <laughs> oh, God. Who tipped you off about the females here? Sorry, Shepard, but they're listening to every word we say. I prefer my Salarian liver served raw. <laughs> He's correct. It was a delicacy in our cycle. <laughs> they look at him like, really? Back on the Normandy, you said Reapers were sighted on Tachunka. Clans Jorgal and Ravenor sighted a few landing parties. But Reapers are up to something. Tuchunka may be a pile of radioactive rubble, but it's our pile. And we'll fight the last Krogan to keep it that way. Radioactive? Ha 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 ha, Garrus. I have to make friends with the one Turian in the galaxy who thinks he's funny. Imagine how I feel. I'm supposed to hate Krogan, but you came along and warmed my heart with your winning personality. I could throw a few Solarians off a cliff, if it'll make you feel better. <laughs> what do you know about these females? They weren't fertile, so we used them as decoys to draw off enemies from the ones who were. But Malin's experiments changed that. These damn piejacks stole them right out from under us. That's a pretty brutal way to treat your women, Rex. The females suggested it. We've had to make a lot of tough choices to ensure we don't all die off. Your females are wise. It's just one more thing that'll get better when the genophage is cured. <laughs> are the Krogan ready to fight the Reapers? Ever since Sovereign showed up, I figured this day would come. My people have spent too much time selling ourselves out as mercenaries. Now we can get back to doing what Krogan do best. Saving everyone else from giant monsters. Never going to let us forget about the Rachni Wars, are you? The last time I was at the Citadel, I didn't see a Turian statue in your honor. <laughs> Just wait till this war is over. <laughs> Been good talking to you again, Rex. It'll be even better when we have a few Solarians for lunch. <laughs> oh, gotta love Rex. I really remiss his snucky attitude. Told me the Turians can't hold out much longer. He's hearing the Reapers happen against the wall. Turians are the biggest fleet. Commander Shepard, it's Major Kirihi. I'd heard you were coming. Good to see you again. Sounds like you've been promoted. Yes, due in no small part to our mission on Vermeer. Hold the line. You saved my men that day. Good to see a friendly face, Major. Garrus Vicarian. Always a pleasure. It seems the Reapers have a way of bringing us together. <laughs> yeah, they do. How'd you get posted to this base, Major? I led the team on Tachanka to found the females. Nasty business. Malin may have meant well, but his operation was crude. Test subjects were unaccounted for. The females easily escaped his lab. What do you think about bringing the female Krogan here? Our scientists say it's important to preserve the females. Evolutionary paradigms. I say when people know you're hiding something valuable, they'll want to steal it. Either way, I have my orders. They'll be your problem soon enough. I guess we're both still feeling the effects of Vermeer. Yes, ironic. 
You destroyed the genophage cure, yet now it's the key to an alliance. Your standoff with Erdnot Rex is legend within STG. I'm sure you saw Rex's entrance. Our colony's three systems away saw it. He wasn't pleased with the reception. Can't say I blame him. Apologies, but better that than a Krogan with a shotgun wandering the base. Think of all the casualties. Our med pig couldn't handle it. Are the Salarians prepared for war with the Reapers? I've heard what they're doing to your Earth. I'm not sure any species can prepare for that. Though rumors suggest you're building a super weapon of some kind. This business with the females is part of it. I need the Tyrian's support, and they need the Krogans. Which is why I never became a diplomat. Too much hand-holding. Leave it to the Dalatressa. <laughs> Security seems high. You expecting trouble? Our motto in STG is to always expect trouble. Failing that, create trouble for someone else. Our enemies have the same idea. A good principle to live by. Who's this? He's a friend. A Prothean. Prothean? Of course. Amazing what they can do with genetic modification these days. Some new psychological tactic, Commander? Give the Reapers a good scare? And what are you really? Drell? Turian? Prothean. Oh. I see. <laughs> He's a real Prothean. <laughs> nice seeing you again, Major. Likewise. And Commander, regardless of what the politicians decide, you can count on my support retaking Earth. You do that. Consider it my way of returning a favor. It would be an honor to fight alongside you again. Good day. Well, at least we have some allies. <laughs> Unlike what the Dalatress said. <laughs> yeah, a bully has very few friends. Yeah, that's what you think, Dalatress. Agree with him or not, our orders are clear. Ensure the smooth handover. This is a restricted area. Please stay back. Who gave the order? Our superiors. That's all that matters. But they're gonna cure the genocide. Everything we've done to stop Please don't touch that. Please don't. Alright, think we're good, guys. So let's go. Another incursion? You have clearance now to see the females, Commander. I hope we can resolve this matter without reenacting the Krogan rebellions. What do you think about handing over the Krogan? I differ from most of my colleagues. Curing the genophage will bring closure to this issue. In the future, the Krogan may yet play some role we can't even imagine. We should let the evolutionary process decide who lives and dies, not galactic politics. Thanks for your time. Of course. Proceed into the elevator when you're ready. Now take this elevator down and someone will... What's happening? Sensors have picked up activity on the perimeter. Hurry, Commander. Someone will meet you below. This doesn't seem good. All specimens are accounted for, sir. Shepard, excellent timing. Good to have you here. Morden? Eyesight still sharp. Surprise, understandable. Hadn't expected to return to work. You're back with STG. Special consultant. Had to be me. Someone else might have gotten it wrong. Helped female Krogan. Fed information to Clan Erdnot. Encouraged political pressure to free females. You must be Rex's inside source. Yes, can explain later. Security warning's not normal. Need to get off world for sake of Krogan. Females had weakened immune systems. Side effect of Malin's cure. These... didn't survive. But what about Malin's research? I thought we saved it. Indeed. Data saved, but not complete. Lacks crucial details to reconstruct cure, but still useful for synthesizing from living tissue. Couldn't save them. 
I'm sure you did everything you could, Morton. Arrived too late. Cannot delay now. One survivor, immune to genophage, can synthesize cure from her tissue. She's still here. Yes, last hope for Krogan. If she dies, genophage cure... Problematic. Please be careful. Krogan's slow to trust. I'm Commander Shepard, Alliance Navy. Are you here to kill me? That would serve no tactical purpose. Erdnot Rex and I are here to take you home. Why? What am I to you? Have the Solarians been mistreating you? Those are my sisters you saw back there. They died in a lot of pain. Did the best we could. And now I know I'm the only one left. That makes me dangerous to a lot of people. What about you, Commander Shepard? Why are you here? You're the future of the Krogan race. I'm fighting for that. Then I hope you brought an army. Alert. Unidentified vessels have breached the perimeter. Give me an update. Outbound communications have been severed. We're cut off. Secure all data to off-site location. What's happening? We have multiple ships inbound. Only one survived, Rex. It might be safer down here. What? So the Solarians can kill her like the others? No deal. If you still want this alliance, get her out of there. Release the female. We're leaving. I can't. Protocol states during lockdown, no specimens. <laughs> Objection noted. Now, please release Krogan. Need to monitor pod as it clears quarantine procedures. Meet us at next checkpoint, Shepard. Likely Cerberus opposes Genophage cure. You'll see Tachanka again, I promise. Get to elevator, Shepard. All right, time for us to go. Jesus. Oh crap. Get back! Commander Shepard, are you alright? Is there another way out of here? Other side of the lab. An emergency exit. I can open it from here. Thank you. Shepard, Cerberus Force is trying to locate female. Quarantine checkpoint under attack. Hurry! Garrus, Javik, let's go. Easy to say until you had to fight the all face to face. 
<laughs> yeah, that's the truth, Garrus. <laughs> there goes the next shadow broker. Careful. There goes the next shadow broker. Alright. Let's go. See anything? Roger that, Morgan. Do more than challenge them. Shepard, meet us at next checkpoint. Server is likely to target. Hurry, next checkpoint. Dang. Let's go. Good luck, Rex. Shepard, last attack compromised security systems. Attempting to compensate. Hang on, we're trying to get to the board. Take him out. We're a little distracted. <laughs> nice one, Shepard. That did it. Just hope it'll keep them off us for a while. Cerberus isn't fooling around. The end of a cycle always marks the beginning of chaos. Yep. But you would know all about that, Javik. <laughs> Commander, stay back. Hostiles just down the hall. Is there an easier way around? You could say that. How do I not have one of those? Go, Commander. I'll cover you. Orion Squad, your orders on a hold position and block access to next checkpoint. Looks like Cerberus got some upgrades. Then let's break their upgrades. Head to head will get us ripped up, Shepard. We may be able to flank them. Or if you just have a few grenades. We have to take out those turrets. To the next checkpoint. I'm sure Cerberus isn't done. You're not wrong there. Gosh, I have to say though. Cerberus must have been tipped off. They got here too fast. Every war has its traitors. Dang it. Didn't know if there was anything out there. Hopefully I didn't miss anything.
The enemy is persistent. They're up top too. See how you hell handle this. I can't get clear shot. Oh yeah. Now that's what I'm talking about. Come on, Morden. More credits. Sentry interface. Nice. Morden. A power conduit must be nearby. Mm. Not scorpion. Get going. Excellent. Can clear us. Wait. Another Cerberus squad. Wait, what is one? Broken brick. Keep up the pressure. Don't let them near the female. With pleasure. I'll take care of these guys. Gotcha. How you holding up? Containment shield strong, but not designed for direct fire. This isn't your problem, Commander. You don't know me. But I'd like to. Hang in there. How many more checkpoints? Just the landing area. Hope Erd not Rex still waiting. Rex can't keep his hands off a fertile female. He'll be there. I'll see you up top. We found the Krogan. Take them out. Looks clear now. Let's get the hell out of here. Shepard, get your ass up here. I can't fly around forever. The female's on the way up to the landing area. You pull this off, and I'm making you an honorary Krogan. <laughs> can't wait for that, Rex. <laughs> I think we're almost there. Shepard, 
You must authorize release. Pod then transfers to loading area. Let's get you out of there. Do it, Garrus. It's done. Yeah, but watch out. We still got Cerberus troopers left. Waiting, Rex. Get you out of there. There they are. That's them. Oh. I can handle myself, Rex. Women. Shatter, you're brokering a treaty between the Krogan and the Turians. If I get Krogan boots on Palavin, the Turians promise me their support. And how does Cerberus get involved? I don't know. The elusive man is up to something. Then keep them at bay. I can't overstate what a victory this treaty would be for the Alliance. We'll need all the help we can get. How's the Prothean device coming? Alliance R&D has officially begun construction. The team has dubbed it Project Crucible. We're throwing everybody who knows how to hold a hammer at it. This is going to be the most ambitious undertaking in human history. Will we get it done? I'm not saying it won't be a challenge, but our researchers tell me the designs are elegant, massive in scope, but strangely simple as well. We can do this, Shepard. You can do this. Never doubt that. No, sir. Good, hack it out.
You have the female, Rex. A cure for the rest of your people can come later. That wasn't the deal. But Palavin needs your reinforcements now. We can't delay. Unless every Krogan gets the cure, there's no alliance. Morden, how long will it take to finish a cure? Need to synthesize base antigen from female. Also requires healthy male Krogan tissue. We'll need a sample. You're looking at it. Acceptable. We'll need you to remain aboard Normandy for a procedure. Uh, let's hope the food's gotten better. <laughs> Formulating a cure that works for every Krogan sounds like a tall order, Morton. Can you do it? Of course. Similar to Genophage Modification Project. Working against own alterations this time. Not as simple as garbage DNA blocking attachment sites. We'll need to counteract shutdown of redundant nervous system, adjust neurotransmitter levels. Got it. We'll create cure, Shepard. Don't need to worry. Then get started, Morton, and make it quick. Always do. We'll be in Med Bay if you'd like to speak more. Eve requires tests. Eve? Female's real name unknown. Normandy, a human vessel. Human mythology seemed appropriate under circumstances. Suggest speaking with her. New perspective. Surprising in Krogan. Now, is there anything else? There's a small matter concerning a ship we've lost contact with. What happened? I'd rather discuss it... in private. Turian problems can't even come close to what I've got. What is it? Some of my men went missing. The rest of it we can discuss... somewhere else. I'll find you both in the war room. Just be ready to talk. At least we got him. Commander. You said one of your ships had gone missing. Crashed, actually. I couldn't speak in front of the Krogan. Our ship went down on Juchanka. Now they're pinned by an advanced guard of Reapers scouting the planet. What are your men doing there? I'm sorry. That's classified. But it's vital they be rescued. They must complete their original mission. It's a matter of... galactic peace. I'll do what I can. I appreciate your help. And understanding. The Solarian Dalatras worries about what the Krogan will do once they're cured. How do you feel? It won't matter if we don't stop the Reapers, but I understand her doubts. The moon you found me on? That's where we made our last stand against the Krogan during the rebellions. They were that relentless. How did it turn out? The Krogan started using asteroids as weapons, directing them against our colonies. We had no choice. The Genophage was our last resort. So yes. Krogan intentions after this war will be a serious concern, but I'd rather have a grateful ally than a resentful enemy. That's all. Of course, Commander. <laughs> Alright, now let's talk to Rex. Hell of a show down there on Sir Kesh. Just like the old days, Shepard. Right down to me pulling your ass out of the fire. I was the one with bullets flying at me. And I gave you the moral support to dodge them. <laughs> uh-huh. You said one of your squads is missing. They were scouting out the Rachni Relay. We've heard rumors of trouble in the area. Rachni? Thought that might get your attention. I have a favor to ask. It's big. Don't tell me they're back. All I know for sure is our scouts went silent as soon as they arrived. I've got Arlac Company, my best unit, on standby. You give the word, and I'll meet you there. I'll see what I can do. Get on it, Shepard. What will you do after the Genophage is cured? Once we deal with the Reapers, most Krogan will want to settle a score with the Turians and Salarians. I won't let them. That isn't our path forward. This time we'll be different. A lot of people will be relieved to hear that. No one wants to repeat history. They know we'd probably win this time, but war has never brought us anything except misery. It's time to focus on rebuilding. 
What's the situation back on Tachanka? I'm still getting scattered reports of Reaper forces arriving. Something big is brewing. I won't let those things take Tuchanka. Not when we're about to cure the Genophage. My people have had enough bad luck in our time. How could there be trouble with the Rachni? They were all but extinct. The last queen promised to disappear forever or be destroyed. I know, I was there. I've got a bad feeling about this. It may not be Rachni, but maybe it is. Could be another invasion. If they're crawling out from under some rock, you know how bad it could get. We need to stop them. Back on Sir Kesh, it looked like the female Krogan could hold her own. Our females don't lack for spirit. For males, a good show of force sorts things out. But females like to talk about it. Then think about it. <sighs> then talk about it some more. No offense. Believe it or not, we sometimes have good ideas, Rex. You should try listening. Yeah, but our women have so many of them. So sometimes I pretend to listen and... Well, let's just say Krogan females have tempers too. That's it for now, Rex. Let's get back to work. Anytime. Hey, Shepard. I like what you've done with the Normandy. Got tired of always hanging around the cargo bay before. I still don't have a window like Liara does, but... Maybe that's because I don't kiss as well. <laughs> <laughs> no comment. Yeah. <laughs> I miss this place. <laughs> Wish I could knock some heads around with you, but duty calls. If the Solarian says my DNA is important, who am I to argue? Oh, gosh, Rex. I've missed you. Yeah, sure, Lia yeah. Liara gets only a window because she's sleeping with Shepard. <laughs> Cerberus has Reaper tech. Commander, we've got new reports of Cerberus activity on Tachanka. I've marked it on the galaxy map. Thank you, trainer. <laughs> Thank you, Farron. The Krogan and the Turians really should get behind the Alliance. They've got so much in common, like shooting things and not wanting to die. And... Now that's about it. So a Prothean, a real live Prothean, has Liara stopped bouncing yet? I'm guessing there may have been some bouncing. So, bringing the Krogan to a war summit went well? You want me to invite the Batarians too? Or the Vorcha? Building alliances is the only way we stand a chance against the Reapers. Yeah, but the Krogan? I'd feel better if we had a tighter plan, like time travel or teaching the Reapers to love. Still, good to have Morden back. The bad guys shouldn't get the monopoly on mad scientists. <laughs> I'm not wrong there, Joker. Sit down to the crew deck. Engineering Adams is here. Aware Krogan females find scars attractive. Garrus loyal, reasonably intelligent, a bit aggressive, almost like Krogan. For the third time, Doctor, I'm not interested. Ah, Shepard. We were just. Are you okay? I'm fine, Rex. You can relax. Can't be too careful. Or put any faith in Solarian doctors. This one is different. Is he? What's that? Simple blood test. What kind? Kind that ends the genophage. Shepard, please. Distraction's counterproductive. Also affecting comfort of patient. He was your inside source, Rex. You can trust him. Solarians have minds like a maze. You never know when they're leading you into a trap. Trap? Eve's release my doing. 
would never have known about her if not for me. That was then. But she's out now. And if she gets hurt, I'll feel it. Understand. But my patient, my responsibility, her welfare a priority, will not allow her to be compromised by anyone. <laughs> you got a quad, Doctor. Keep her safe. Our females have endured enough. Don't forget, still need your tissue sample. I'll be back. <laughs> Common phobia. Fear of needles. Or Solarian doctors. Now have work to do. Prefer females of the species. Oh, they have the crew quarters. Maybe with an inhibitor. No, 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 no. Entire catalyzing process would fail. It's immune. I can't imagine anything so traumatic. Are you sure you're okay, Karen? I wouldn't wish a collector abduction on my worst enemy. But it's behind me now. I'm fine. But it makes me think of Earth and all the other Reaper-occupied worlds. What are the Reapers doing to the people who live on all those worlds? As we sit here, enjoying our coffee. How many souls are in agony this very moment? Millions? Billions? Go, oh, Greg. I lied. I'm not fine. Hello, Commander. Everything okay in the med bay? Yes. Morden would just like some space to work with Eve. He kicked you out? Oh, no. I just felt I was getting in his way. I'll return when I'm needed. <laughs> Let's go see about Garrus real quick before we talk to the Morden and the female. Shepard, they say female Krogan have a thing for guys with scars. So I've heard. I've got a few myself. Here's hoping nobody's planning an arranged marriage to cement this deal. Though I have to say, I admire <laughs> Eve. The things she must have endured living with the genophage. And now, to top it all off, she's her people's last hope. Imagine the pressure. It takes real courage to face that. I hope we can measure up. That makes two of us on there, Garrus. Thank you for saving my life, Commander. I didn't think the Krogan had any allies left in the galaxy. We owe a lot to you, even if most people have forgotten that. They can be forgiven. Our actions have hardly inspired friendship. Part of being friends is knowing each other's name. I feel bad that I don't know yours. I surrendered it the day I became a shaman of the female clan. I belong to my sisters now. But perhaps one day, when this is over, you can know it. I didn't realize the Krogan had female shamans. Wisdom comes from pain, and the Genophage has made us very wise. Rather than surrender to despair, a few of us chose to preserve the ancient ways. We safeguard our culture, our knowledge, our secrets. So when our children live again, the Krogan will flourish. How were you initiated? You're locked in a cave for seven days with just enough food to last. On the eighth, you'll starve. What does that prove? Your resolve. Every acolyte is given a chance. You either claw your way out through the rock with your bare hands, or you die. How did you make it out alive? I started digging the wrong way. I was in complete darkness. Nothing other than my own heartbeat to sustain me. What happened? I found this. A simple crystal, but it became my chisel. Take it as a reminder, Commander. In the darkest hour, there is always a way out. What do you think of Rex? When he's not trying to sire half of Tachanka, he's the best thing that's happened to the Krogan. But I won't tell him that. His head's big enough already. <laughs> Literally. He's turned into a strong leader. I know in his heart Rex wants what's best for us. Though not all the other clans see it that way. Why would the other clans give Rex trouble? You'd think they'd want a better future. It's not in the nature of our males to cooperate. They've evolved to be selfish. 
Their only concern is survival. Rex is different. He's a mutant. And that you can tell him. Do you think Rex will want revenge for the genophage? Some clans will expect it, but I hope Rex resists. He understands the cycle of violence must end if Krogan are ever to have a voice in galactic politics. Still, he's just one Krogan. If enough clans demand it, he may not be able to stop them. If you don't mind me asking, what's it been like living with the genophage? I knew sisters who couldn't bear the shame of being infertile. They would wander off into the wastelands, hoping a thresher maw would kill them and end their torment. Did the thought ever cross your mind? Yes. After my first stillborn. What kept you from ending your own life? When my child didn't draw breath, that's when my life truly began. The genophage forces us to live on hope alone. There is nothing else. There is no reason to exist other than the hope that the next day will bring change. And if it doesn't, there is always the next. How do you think things will change after the genophage is cured? Our species will find its balance again. Females will help shape the future, like in the ancient days, before we were just pawns of power-hungry males. <laughs> Most seem hell-bent on shooting anything that looks at them wrong. What else is there for them to do? Because of the genophage, they become wandering killers, seeking targets to justify their existence, excuses to earn them honor. How'd you get involved in Malin's experiments? The other females and I volunteered. We heard Malin was trying to cure the genophage for Clan Werelock. Aren't they a rival clan? Rivalries are the invention of the males. Under their rule, Tachanka has laid in ruins for over a thousand years. It's time females took back our place in society and resurrected our future. Malin was our best hope. Would you go to Malin again? Absolutely. It only takes one candle to light a fire, and then the darkness is no more. I found Malon's lab. It looked like a dungeon. His experiments were brutal. We learned that too late. He meant well, but his methods grew more barbaric as he went. We finally escaped into the rubble. Eventually, a Solarian team found us. They saved our lives. We were so sick. I'm sorry none of the other females survived. I know. The youngest one, Kern, was the last to go. But she knew she would enter the void free of this curse, and then smile when she looked down upon the children of Tachanka. Her spirit will be the midwife to my firstborn. How has Morden been treating you? Better than Krogan males do. He's not like a typical Solarian. No, no, no. Organ redundancy results in new period before metaphase. Can't alter that. Damage to Telomere's premature aging. He does that. But I sense pain in him, too. He told me about his work on the genophage. I should consider him an enemy. Yet I think seeing my sisters and I changed something in him. Asari Borgia offspring have an allergy to dairy and... Well, it wasn't his ear. <laughs> Thanks for talking to me. It's my pleasure, Commander. I'm glad to see humans treat their women with respect. Your people have placed a lot of responsibility on you. No more than your people have put on you. <laughs> then maybe we can show the men how it's done. Deal. <laughs> Shepard, blood work complete. Indicates significant stress on Eve's system. Malin's data thorough. Fortunately detailed as well. Have used notes to improve her condition. Have you determined why she's immune? Genophage targeted hormone production during pregnancy. Modification project used same modality. Her immunity, totally different. Targeted glands now obsolete, like human appendix. Other glands mutated to produce proper hormones, enable viable birth. Also explains her weakness. Gland substitution, imperfect. Health trouble. You think you can make this work for all, Krogan? Yes. We'll use Eve's tissue to produce mutagen, alter gland function across entire species. Must improve mutagen as well, tune hormone production, long-term illness for all Krogan otherwise. So we did the right thing by saving the data? Indeed. Would be much harder to treat Eve without it. Maybe impossible. And all those experiments we saw back on Tachanka? Monstrous, repulsive, but now with purpose. Victims didn't die for nothing. So the end justifies the means. Not my means. But you're using the data. 
Encouraging more experiments like Malin's. Encouragement irrelevant. We'll always be scientists willing to perform unethical tests. Can't change that. But can help Eve. Can cure Genophage. Won't ignore data vital to our survival because of unethical origins. Any word on Malin himself? No. Ordered teams to search for him when trying to help Eve. Nothing so far. Large galaxy. Lots of places to hide. Could already be dead for all we know. Would kill him now, if possible. Unless he could help. How's she doing? No fever currently. Heart rate elevated. Likely stress. Eating appropriately. Could use another blanket. Something soft. Prefer to let her recover fully before synthesizing cure. My medical recommendation. My people don't have time for that. Her opinion, somewhat different. You care about her. My patient. My responsibility. Found her at STG base. Three doctors injured trying to restrain her. Undid arm restraints. Didn't resist when she grabbed me. Promised to help her. She said, please. You always defended your genophage work. What changed your mind? Never changed mind. Genophage proper decision at time. New circumstances necessitate course correction. Those circumstances being? Reaper invasion. Turians doomed without Krogan support. Krogan need unified threat. Outlet for aggression. Cooperative symbiosis. Nothing else? No personal stake here? Getting old, Shepard. Not many years left. But still best candidate for project. Few Solarian scientists interested in genophage. None with my expertise. Had to be me. Someone else might have gotten it wrong. Possibly. Stakes too high for an experience. But not about them. My work. My job to put it right. To prove I can. Nice talking with you, Morden. Thank you, Shepard. Glad to be back. You planning to stick around when this is over? Until Reaper's dealt with, at least. Then, not sure. Have made impact on Galaxy. Genophage modification, genophage cure, work against collectors, decisions, mistakes. Might go somewhere sunny, sit on beach, look at ocean, collect seashells. <laughs> you go crazy inside an hour. Might run tests on the seashells. <laughs> yeah, that might keep more than sane. <laughs> Anyways, guys, we are going to stop it here for now. So that will be all for this time. If y'all enjoyed this episode, please leave a like and comment, and please subscribe. And I do hope to see y'all well, so in the next episode, guys. See y'all later. Bye-bye, guys. I know what happened to your civilization. Why did such an enlightened race disappear? Enlightened? Well, it seemed that way. And now that I am here... I wonder what it's like waking up 50,000 years later to a new galaxy. I believe this cycle cares too much about what other species think. Krogan, Turian, Solarian, all were primitives in my time. What good does their help do now? We can't win this war on our own. Then demand their help. Do not indulge their selfish requests. What will saving one Krogan matter? If only it were that simple. If they get in your way, destroy them. Excuse me? I apologize. The previous occupant of this room left traces of himself. I have absorbed some of them. Yes, Grunt. He was a strong one. Maybe it's best if I let you recover. That would be... Oh, well,